Currently, the United States spends more on healthcare than any other country. Unfortunately, this higher level of spending does not result in better health outcomes. As we consider a reallocation of our healthcare dollars, we should strive to achieve these goals. One, increase the use of high value services. Two, enhance patient-centered outcomes. And three, promote efficient expenditures. Unfortunately, the current way we pay providers is fee for service, which encourages clinicians to see more patients and order more services in an almost assembly line fashion. Under this system, providers are rewarded for the volume, not quality, of care they provide. Efforts are underway to transition provider payment from fee-for-service to value-based payment models, including bundled payments, accountable care organizations, and global budgets. These alternative payment models incentivize providers to meet quality, not quantity metrics. However, providers cannot successfully reach these value-based goals if their patients face significant barriers to access the care they need. Increasingly, patients are confronted with administrative red tape, high out-of-pocket costs, and limited provider choice that make it difficult for them to adhere to recommended treatments. Thankfully, there is a potential solution to align patient and provider goals. Value-based insurance design eliminates barriers to allow patients to better access high-value care. Under this scenario, clinicians are paid based on quality, not volume, and consumer cost sharing is based on health impact of services, not price. The alignment of provider-facing and consumer engagement initiatives is a necessary and critical step to improve quality of care, enhance patient experience, and contain cost growth.